New details tonight about the Oceanside accident that killed three members of a family. Three other family members are still recovering from their injuries. And our 10 News reporter Laura Acevedo spoke to the co-worker of the man who lost his two sisters and his mother. The memorial here at the accident scene is growing. Now the family was driving through Oceanside Boulevard when the 19 year old plowed into their car, destroying what friends call a very close family. Rick Brule's co-worker Remy Arango got the call in the middle of their work day at North County Ford. He came into my office and said, I gotta go. Arango's family had been in an accident. They're a very close family. Uh, you know, they spend holidays together. They travel together. They have family in Mexico. Arango's mom and two sisters were killed in the accident on Tuesday. His father, niece, and brother-in-law seriously hurt. Brule rushing to his friend's side at the hospital. They were horrific. They were, I've never seen such heartbreak in my life. Oceanside police say 19 year old Mason Fish ran a red light T-boning the family's car. Records show Fish's license was suspended or revoked on January 26th. The system's broken in a way. Some Something is not uh, keeping these people off the road. This guy should have never been on the road. Fish was arrested. Officers say he was driving under the influence of a controlled substance. This person that was on drugs Breaking the law has destroyed a, a, a big core part of a really close family. Arango's co-workers immediately started a GoFundMe to help their loyal employee. To help cover the monumental expenses because he's going to have, they're going to have a lot of expenses. The 13 year old and her grandfather have already been released from the hospital. If you'd like to donate to the GoFundMe, you can find that on our website, 10news.com. Reporting in Oceanside, Laura Acevedo, 10 News.